How to create an online survey questionnaire to find out what your prospects really want. Hi guys, this is Jennifer Asada here from the West Coast of Ireland and I'm going to show you as fast as possible um, how to create an online survey questionnaire but more specifically how to create an efficient online survey questionnaire to find out what your prospects really want. Um, this is a good tool to have to use when you have uh, a list of prospects of people who have uh, opted into your lead capture pages to find out more about uh, what you have to offer, your, your products, your services, your business maybe that you're exposing on the internet. Um, however, they're not really responding, they're not really buying from you, they're not really joining you in your business. So an online survey uh, at that point is a good idea to have. So I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. Now, so the first thing you want to do is find a software um, where you can create your survey. So a very good one is SurveyMonkey. Okay, not the only one, but it is free, uh, straightforward, simple enough to use. If you go to surveymonkey.com, create an account there, all you have to do is provide um, you know, the usual a username, a password, and your email address, and then you're good to go. Okay, so here we are, you're inside your SurveyMonkey account, and so you can read a little bit, it gives you a few tips on how to create your um, survey, especially if you've never done this before. Uh, but, you know, I find it always, you know, the best thing to do is just go and do it, you know. So first thing you're going to do is uh, create survey, click on the green button, create survey, and we're going to actually um, create an example of a survey. So let's say you are sending a survey or you're wanting to send a survey to a list of prospects who have opted into your lead capture page to find out about um, how to learn how to make money on the internet. Let's say they want to learn, they've never done this before, they want to find out uh, how they can um, create an income using the internet. So let's call then based on that, your title is going to be something like um, learn how to make money. Now, of course, it can be anything related to your products, your services that you're offering. Um, but let's pretend we are offering system that teaches you how to make money online questionnaire because this is what it is okay I want to make it look more like a title learn how to make money online questionnaire select categories so just choose something there that uh, you feel is kind of related to what you're doing and let's go Now, my advice here is to keep your questionnaire short, simple, straightforward, to the point, especially at first, because your main purpose is to obtain uh, responses, okay? So you don't want to make it too long and complicated. Make it short at first, um, and maybe later on you can expand, okay? But you want to get your prospects to respond. You want to create, get them to um, interact with you, really. So add page titles. So we already have a title. So this is going to be more like kind of a, a subtitle. Okay. So in case you're going to have different parts to your survey, it could be like, uh, you know, the subtitle of what that part is about. So here, I'm just going to put something simple like, uh, help me help, help you. It's kind of my subtitle message. Page description, again, you can put something short saying, um, take 30 seconds to answer these three questions. Okay, it's, we're going to do just three questions. Of course, you can have more, but remember, keep it short is better. Answer these three questions to help me serve you better. Okay just for now, just to keep it simple. Now you can rephrase that. Okay, always put yourself in the shoes of the prospects. You know, how would you react when you read something like this? You know, try different version 
and go with um, your um, you know best uh, judgment save now we're good to create the questions so you see here on the left you're going to have a list of different type of questions you can choose from so just again for the sake of this example we're going to choose three different type of questions so first i want to choose a drop down type of question so you just go to add and that is going to feed into your page which do you like best now you have a question that you can overwrite and my first question i want to ask my prospects is i want to know if do you have any prior experience making money online I want to know if they've done this before or not now because it's a drop down you're going to give them now it's giving you a question bank now you can ign ignore this okay this is annoying so i'm going to untick this because i don't want suggested question i want to create my own answers so get rid of the option apple and first possible answer would be something like uh, yes i am currently making money online is a possible answer second one i would say i have tried but I have tried making money online. Okay, again, I'll keep it short, um, but got very little to no results, for example. Okay, so they have some kind of experience. And the third one is going to be no. No, I haven't, and I want to learn of course okay so again word choice is very important so spend some time carefully um, phrasing those answers making sure that they're not um, leading in any way as well okay oh yeah so then we want to sorry you can't see my screen here bottom of the screen save and that's your first question and possible answers published at any time you can go to the preview and test button that's going to show you exactly what your prospects are going to see on the survey okay so this is what they're going to see the title the subtitle the description the first question and once they're done answering the survey they're going to go to done and that's it so we're going to cancel because we're not there yet now we want to add a second question this time i'm going to choose the multiple choice okay so i'm going to go to add and let it load into your screen and my second question is going to be to do with um, the level of income what do they want to earn okay so again the phrasing is very important um, but I want to keep it um, kind of friendly but serious um, anyway I'm going to ask um, what level of income are you looking to um, what kind of income are you looking to generate with your online business okay this does a few things asking for the income but also let them know that this is an online business that it's not a job that it's something that they will be working for themselves um, answers now possible again this time it's multiple choice so multiple choice means they're going to click to tick the answer um, so I don't know we'll start at um, 
first level of income maybe some people just want to make you know an extra an extra hundred five hundred dollars a month uh, additional income you know or maybe uh, they want to make a bit more than that so let's create um, I don't know okay for example and two thousand two five now you can add another you can add okay it gives you three possible answers but of course you can add as many as you want so add another choice and we're going to make uh, the last one above um, five thousand dollars for example okay now of course it's just for the example so again we're going to go to the bottom of the page that says save always save as you go along and for the third question i want to use this time a text answer okay so one where the prospect will actually have to type in their answer for that i like to use the one that says comment box you also have a single text box but the comment box actually okay so let's add it gives you a box that is expandable so they can actually make it bigger if they need to and for my third question i'm going to ask them uh, the big question <laughs> is what is your main um, motivation for wanting to learn Okay, notice that the word learn is very important there because it reinforces the fact that they are going to have to learn something. Wanting to learn um, how to make money online. Right? And save. now let's see let's go back to the preview and test see what it looks like now this is what my survey is going to look like let me make it a bit bigger there you are okay so Learn how to make money online questionnaire. Help me help you take 30 seconds to answer this three question. Help me serve you better. Do you have any prior experience making money online? Multiple choice answers in drop down. What level income are you looking to generate? So here they can tick. And what is your main motivation? They can type in the answer. And I don't know why we have what is your favorite fruit that got in there somehow. Uh, but not to worry, we're going to delete that one because that not is that is not very um, relevant to what we want to find out. So let's delete this one. Thank you. And that's it. So you have your survey ready to be sent. The next step. You got it go uh, on the top right corner is to collect responses so you're going to want to send that survey to your prospects so um, i like to use the web link collector it gives you a couple of other options um, this is the one that's going to generate the link so you tick that one so that you can share that link that url anywhere that you like this is how it's going to look like um so what you're going to do you're going to copy it save it somewhere and use it inside your emails your messages uh, that you're going to send you can have it on your website on your blog as well okay so that's how you're going to collect your response and the last tab here is analyze results so as you do collect responses you can come back here to watch what is going on it's going to give you a summary 
of the question answers. It's going to give you trend. It's going to give you individual response. So you can really analyze and learn from this. All right. So um, that's how simple it is. Okay. It was. It seemed a bit tricky, but it's actually very simple to create an online survey. So do go ahead, create one, send it, see how you get on, see what results you get, and you can always improve from there. Um, again, my name is Jennifer Asada. And to find out more about myself, how to build your business online, expose your business on the internet, please come and visit me on jenniferasada.com. I will see you there. And as always, I look forward to guiding you. And bye for now.